old shit till my day's over And I'm not stopping till we're done A quitter ain't me, I never back down once Do it for the ones who skip their lunch Do it for the ones who skip on punch Do it for everyone who lives for fun So come on darling, I know that you're the one Like oh no, look at the odds It's a ten to one, they're a bunch of dogs Remember when we played hopscotch in the schoolyard Now we drink them like, oh no, look at the odds, it's a ten to one, they're a bunch of dogs Remember when we play ups, go to the schoolyard, now we drink them pups G'day everyone, welcome to the tutorial for Hopscotch by the Terrys. I've seen this one popping up in the requests a lot on my recent videos, so I figured I would jump straight on, get into it. Um, I did clarify the chords with Louis, the guitarist of the Terrys himself, so it's correct. It's pretty much what I've got here. Um, I just couldn't figure out the solo and like the lead lick, but as long as you guys have the rhythm, you can learn it. So here we are today. Before we get into it though, just make sure you hit like, hit subscribe. If you've got any tutorial requests, just leave a comment down below and I'll try my best to get around to it. Um, but yeah, let's just jump straight into this one. Alright, so this one here is... I'm gonna say simple. I think simple is probably the best word for it. It's three chords in a four chord progression um, and it's just rinse and repeat throughout the entire song. So we start off with an E chord. This is for the verse but same thing for the chorus. I do a little variation on the chorus, which I'll explain later. But what we've got is, we start off on an E bar chord. Or E power chord. I play it like that. So we've got fret 7 on the A. Fret 9 on the D. 9 on the G. And with my ring finger, I'm using the end of it to press down on fret 3 of the B as well. So you can just do a power chord. Or you can do the full. It just depends on if your finger can do it really. There's no major difference. So we start off with an E. Then we go to a C sharp minor. So we're up to fret 4 on the A. 6 on the D. 6 on the G. 5 on the B. Then we take that shape from our C sharp minor up to an A. So same shape up here is 5 on the E, 7 on the A, 7 on the D, 6 on the G. And then back to our E. and then rinse and repeat. So all together it should sound like again. So strumming pattern, I'll play it slower, is down, 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 Just like that. Okay, so that's the verses. 
Chorus is pretty much the exact same, except the only difference I like to make is that when we're playing the chorus, instead of playing the first E up here, I like to play an open sort of E major right at the top. So we've got two on the A, two on the D, one on the G. So with the chorus it goes like oh no, look at the odds, it's ten to one, a bunch of dogs. Temper when we play up scotch in the schoolyard, we drink them pops like oh no, look at the odds, it's ten to one, a bunch of dogs. Never when we play up scotch in the schoolyard, now we drink them pops. Back to the verse. Okay, so chorus. We start on our open E, C sharp minor, A, and then back to this E up here. I just think starting with this one kind of opens it up for the chorus. I don't know, might just be my personal preference. If you want to play the same rotation throughout the entire song, by all means. Um, but yeah, personal preference, I like to play my first E up here. And then strumming pattern I think is pretty much identical. Like down, 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 up, down, down. So the other thing I should mention is between the chords I'm doing like a little up down as well. So I go down, down, up down, up down, 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 up down, down. And that is pretty much all I have for this tutorial. Um, without the intro sort of riff or the solo, it's just that. It's just that chord progression with the strumming pattern. So if you enjoyed this tutorial, leave a thumbs up, hit subscribe, um, send it to the Terrys, show them you playing the song, chuck me a tag, and um, yeah, I'd be super stoked. If you've got any tutorial requests, leave a comment down in the link below, um, and I will try and work my way through it. But yeah, cheers for watching, and hopefully we'll see each other soon.